special Wednesdays? Yes, sir. On at night now? Yes, sir. Got special things going on. The start of something special. Feeling so special. Special Wednesdays, 8 to 11 p.m. Right here on ksfs.sfsu.edu. This was something special. Uh, my name is Tiny Dickerman, and I am a singer, songwriter, performer from North Carolina. So, what are you currently working on right now? Currently, I am working on uh, another small uh, EP. It's going to be about five to seven songs with one producer. Uh, his name is Apple Jack. Cool. He's a producer and a DJ out of Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, nice. And I'm also working on my album. Those are the only the in studio projects I'm working on, but I'm also like having. I have shows, planning events, and, uh, yeah. Good stuff. What, what was Robot Heart off of? Oh, that was just, um, a song I just wanted to release. Okay. It's not on anything. Okay. I can dig it. <laughs> Most people know you from working with Little Brother. What's your favorite song that you've done with them? Probably After the Party. Mm-hmm. I feel it. Yeah. After the Party. And then what's it like working with them? Um, it's cool to work with them. Um. They're, I mean, Pooh and Fonte have, like, two different personalities, mm-hmm. but they're so much alike. They are both, like, fun, funny guys when you get to the studio. It's, it's like, half the time is fun time, and half the time is, like, let's get this work done. Time. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, it's cool. They're like brothers. So. That's dope. So, you also worked with Nicolay. What was your favorite song that you did with him? Uh, definitely the studio life. Nice. And then, um, what's it like to work with him? I haven't been in the studio with oh. him when I recorded the song. Mm-hmm. I was with Fonte. But, um, I performed with him, and it's always fun performing with him, so. He's a very talented, uh, musician, so it's always cool and fun. Good stuff. So then you just kind of a couple months ago released the Doug and Patty EP. I read online that it was just kind of super random that it became the Doug and Patty EP. Is that what really happened? Yeah. Um, well, the name, well, actually, yeah, pretty much. Um, <laughs> I knew it uh, a long idea. We uh, have been planning on um, doing an album together, something together, like we first met. Mm-hmm. I first met him in 2007. And so, we just, we just said, oh, no, forget it, just do it, and record a bunch of songs, and, like, the name for it was really just out of nowhere, <laughs> we were just, like, trying to brainstorm, I was trying to think of, like, two people that we all can relate to, like, mm-hmm. and, and, like, most people know, and we were, like, kind of like a Bonnie and Clyde type thing. Yeah. And we're, I guess we're big kids, and we, like... And all that. <laughs> so I, uh, I was like, how about Doug and Patty? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, yes, okay. And then after the game, we started, I, I tried to like incorporate the, the song, the title, and mm-hmm. then later came the skit. So. Dope. It, t- it kind of took everybody back to their childhood, which was hella cool. Yeah. What's your favorite song on there? My favorite song on there, it'll probably have to be. There's a, there's a tie between Just Funny Love mm-hmm. and Always. Always is my favorite. I still bump that like every other day. <laughs> yeah, Always, that's because that's a cute story. Just, I really like the song. Yeah, it's really beautiful. No problem. <laughs> and then as far as Carlita's Way, what was that like for you, just to kind of really do your own thing? Um, well, that was, that was actually my own, my first um, project, a piece of work that I released out to the public. Mm-hmm. So that was, it was pretty exciting, um, knowing that people really were looking for my music and wanted to have, grab hold of it, have it, and like, so that was the first piece that people like we're really trying to get their hands on and that's a good feeling having people want your music and want to listen to your music so 
Definitely. And then do you have a favorite song on there? I'm all about favorites. <laughs> I like most of them. All of them. Uh, I guess the song on there called like. So, kind of random questions. Are you still attending N- NCCU? Uh, no, I graduated uh, May of 09. So a year ago I graduated. Oh, good stuff. What was your major? Just curious. Theater performance. Oh, nice. That's dope. And then what are you listening to right now? What are you bumping? Um, currently with the Ruth album. Yes. Um, but I listen to a little bit of everything. Mm-hmm. I listen to Zero Seven. Uh, um, well, pretty much, pretty much, I just listen to the Ruth album lately. <laughs> that's a winner and, uh, right there. And a little dragon. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, that's pretty much right now. Cool. Any any California dates? You gonna fly out here anytime soon? Um, I'm working on it. Yes. I'm trying to get a show out there, or even just come out there and have like a, a something. <laughs> but can, I, it's in the works right now. You can definitely come kick it at the at the San Francisco State Radio Studio. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I remember that too. I'm like, hey girl, you know what you said. For real. <laughs> Let's make it happen. And then, um, so, are you in the beginning stages of the album, or kind of in the middle, or where are you at with the album? Um, actually, I'm probably in the middle, where I was in the end, but I have, I have pretty much lost, um, most of the songs that I had for the album. Aww. That's technology for you. <sighs> but, um, so I just had to start all, all over again. Mm-hmm. But it, I guess it's kind of a good thing, because... I'm, I'm, I feel like I've grown as an artist, and I started the song a long time ago. Mm-hmm. So, so I had to start all over again, but it's just okay because I don't know, everything happens for a reason, I guess. Definitely. And then, um, how far are you guys on that next EP? Um, he's actually sending me beats right now, like he's just sending me to my uh, email account. So, um, as soon as I get to the studio to record that. So we're just on the beginning, beginning stages, but it shouldn't take too long because it's only going to be like five to seven songs. Cool, cool. Any idea of the name, or are you guys going to do that afterwards? Um, well, he, he run, I always see on my Twitter page, I mm-hmm. say Extraordinary Nobody, and he said we should name it that, and I'm not against it. Yeah, that sounds cool. <laughs> like Extraordinary Nobody, that's like who I am, I guess. That's cool. Special Wednesdays? Yes, sir. On at night now? Yes, sir. Got special things going on. The start of something special. Feeling so special. Special Wednesdays, 8 to 11 p.m. Right here on KSFS. Dot sfsu.edu. This was something special.